peace and blessings. It's Wednesday, May the 4th, 2022. Today's topic, cancer. I used to have the opinion that nobody knew more about cancer than me because I studied it longer and more in depth than anybody. But I won't go out that far on a limb because every time you think you know something about cancer something else pops up I do know that many people are falsely diagnosed with cancer because uh, we all have cancer cells uh, I have a sister that had cancer and they wanted to go the route of giving her all this chemotherapy and all that crap and naturally I said uh uh no don't do that don't do that do that my sister, I'm not going to let them do that to you. She took my advice and went on 48, 49, 50 years without any treatment. She just changed the way her living. She quit smoking. <laughs> quit eating starch. She quit doing things that were feeding the cancer. Here are some things that feed cancer. Sugar. Meat. God, wow, it is so hard to get those two food items, or what I should say, cancer feeding items out of people's lifestyle. Hey, I, I can't knock you for it. I used to eat it. But, uh, we're destroying ourselves. The people who are your natural historical enemies, they don't have to do anything. They're poisoning us in the air, water, food, and through electromagnetic pollution, not to mention the genetically modified organism. Uh, I had a client, well, I had many of them that I helped you know, with cancer because that seemed to be the number one problem. All of them do well until they go to the poisoners. Look up Pharmacia, Pharmacon, Pharmacia, and you'll find that they are sorcerers and poisoners. They haven't cured anything. This is Dr. Elijah Grant. Stay tuned for part two. It's going to blow your mind, I guarantee you.